Hello students. Welcome to Teach You Smart. Let's continue our journey through mensuration. Today we are going to open up a new topic, solid shapes. As we all know, shapes are of two types, plain shapes and solid shapes. What is a plain shape and a solid shape? Plain shapes are two-dimensional shapes and solid shapes are three-dimensional shapes. See, it's a matchbox and it's a three-dimensional shape. It is in the shape of a cuboid. Look into its faces. Each face is a rectangle. That is, its faces are two-dimensional shapes. This is a Rubik's cube, and its shape can be named, a cube. Here all faces are squares, which is a two-dimensional shape. This is an ice cream cup, which is in the shape of a cone, and it has two faces. The base is a circle. And when we cut, and open the curved face, we get a sector. See, the biscuit pack is in the shape of a cylinder. Both ends of the cylinder are circles. And when we cut and open the curved surface, we get a rectangle. That is, two-dimensional figures can be identified as the faces of three-dimensional shapes. Let's check it. In a cuboid, there are six faces. Each is rectangular and opposite faces are congruent. So there are three pairs of congruent faces. In a cube, all faces are squares that are congruent. And in a cylinder, there is one curved surface and two circular faces that are congruent. These cylinders are called right circular cylinders. We know, two-dimensional shapes or plane shapes have both area and perimeter. Similarly, three-dimensional shapes or solid shapes have surface area and volume. Before winding up, let's check how much you understood by doing an activity. Find the number of faces in. First, a square pyramid. Second, a triangular prism. That's all for now. See you in the next class.